Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to solve a problem where the question is d square plus a square whole square into y equal to sin ax. Now writing the auxiliary equation is m square plus a square whole square equal to 0. Since it is whole square, let's write it as two factors separately. Now by equating both the factors to 0, we get m square plus a square equal to 0 and m square plus a square equal to 0. Then from this m square is equal to minus a square even here m square is equal to minus a square and m will be plus or minus root of minus a square is a i and he, even here m values plus or minus a i. So this is of the form alpha plus or minus i beta where alpha is 0 and beta is j. So complementary function is e power alpha x into since we get two roots instead of one constant we have to write linear function c1 plus c2 x into cos beta x plus c3 write it separately plus c3 plus c4 x into sin beta x by substitution e power 0 x is 1 so c1 plus c2 x into cos beta x plus c3 plus c4 x into sin beta x. So we completed the complementary function. Coming to the particular integral, right hand side we have sin ax and in the denominator it is d square plus a square, d square plus a square and we have whole square. Now as per the procedure, wherever d square is there, we have to substitute a square with a minus sign outside. By doing so, we get denominator minus a square plus a square then whole square so denominator becomes 0 when denominator becomes 0 we have to multiply numerator by x and differentiate denominator so x into sin ax divided by 2 into d square plus a square into 2d but once again we have to substitute d square as minus a square by doing so we get x into sin ax by 2 into minus a square plus a square into 2d since this term is 0 the entire denominator is 0 so x sin ax by 0 so again multiply numerator by x and differentiate the denominator already there is an x so it becomes x square into sin ax divided by here this is 4 and d when I multiply d cube plus a e square so this term is rewritten as 4 when d is multiplied inside d cube plus a d actually it is a square d so after multiplying the d it is a square d so d cube plus a square d this we are going to differentiate so let's write the 4 as it is then d cube is 3 d square then we have plus a square d its differentiation is only a square once again d square will be replaced as a square with a minus sign outside so it is x square into sin ax by 4 into 3 into minus a whole square plus a square so the denominator after simplification is going to become this entire term is minus 2a square 
because minus 3a square plus a square is minus 2a square into 4 is minus 8a square. So, we have to write the complete solution which is cf plus pi. So, y equal to cf we have c1 plus c2 x into cos ax plus c3 plus c4x into sin ax. So even here this beta can be replaced as a because the value of beta is a. So it is cos ax and sin ax. In the final answer it is c1 plus c2x into cos ax plus c3 plus c4x into sin ax and the last one particular integral is minus x square sin ax by 8a square.